Wow, a lot of developments to monitor there. Thanks. Back here today could be a pretty critical one. Turning point, that is, in the oil battle here in Seattle. Port of Seattle commissioners are meeting this afternoon. They will look at the fight to parks, shells, oil rigs at Terminal 5. And time here is critical. Coma Force Lee Stoll is live in Everett, where one of those rigs is headed for Seattle. And it could just dock within a few hours. Lee? Yeah, we're actually up here in Everett. We're tracking the Noble Discoverer. It's heading to Everett right now and could dock here as early as tonight. It, it's expected to load and unload some supplies before it then heads to Seattle. It's part of Shell's uh, drilling rig uh, fleet, as we mentioned. Now, Shell says that they are still on course to park that fleet at Terminal 5, including the 400-foot Polar Pioneer, which is expected to dock this week as well. Right now it's in Port Angeles. The city leases that space to Foss Maritime and Shell is their client. But remember last week, Seattle Mayor Ed Murray said the rigs should stay put and urged the port to reconsider its lease with Foss. Protesters have been practicing to challenge the rigs in kayaks. They also had some heated words at yesterday's city council meeting. All because of the current cesspool of corruption at the Port of Seattle which has secret meetings with Shell's people for months concocting this filthy deal. Now, protesters have certainly organized to fight these rigs, but a contingent is also in town from Alaska pleading for the plan to move ahead because in their communities, jobs are on the line. Now, today's meeting starts at noon. The commissioners could then break away for an executive session starting at about 1 o'clock. We, of course, will be there and we'll let you know what happens. In Everett this morning, I'm Lee Stoll, Como 4 News. A lot of people watching this one, Lee. It'll be interesting to see what happens. Yep. Meanwhile,